Hey guys, Aaron Rennick White here, Middell Public Schools. Uh, today we're going to have a look at our new line boards uh, here in the district, and we're going to specifically talk about your browser options. Uh, we've recently pushed both Firefox uh, to uh, Firefox and Chromium. Chromium is on every board in the district. Firefox, uh, right now, has specifically been pushed to the elementary uh, boards. Uh, secondary sites, if you're interested in that browser after watching this video, let us know and we'll get it pushed here. Uh, just put a ticket in on the new line side. Um, so, we're on the start screen here. Uh, to get out of here, you just tap the board and it's gonna bring you to the home screen uh, where you can find all of our features of our board um, and then especially getting to browser. So the first thing I'm gonna have you guys do, uh, you may or may not right here underneath your main six options have some shortcuts. Um, what I'm gonna have us do is add the shortcut to Chromium, which is our recommended version that you use for, for Chrome for all of our Google things, and then Firefox, uh, which is a super good media-based option. So uh, Go Noodle, uh, PBS Kids, uh, your Envision videos, things like that, okay? So uh, that's what we're gonna do first. So if you hit this Add button, and this is how, also how you get rid of some of those options. If you're looking at your board and, and they're there, uh, find the Add option that's there, and it's gonna change this menu up on the right-hand side. You're gonna click on the third tab, it's kind of a, a nine square, uh, and then you're gonna see all of the gadgets that can be added to that space. Uh, we're gonna choose Chromium. My screen here may not exactly match yours, so just make sure you know, you're know you looking through it. If you don't see it on this first screen, uh, there's two dots right here. That's letting me know that I have a second page to go to. I can also add Firefox. So now I've got Chromium and Firefox down here underneath my shortcuts of my main options that I use the board. Uh, you can add any other features that you have on here that you may maybe use regularly. I recommend the classroom tools, and we'll talk about that in another video. Uh, once you're done adding those shortcuts, go ahead and hit the X in the top right-hand corner of that little screen, and then that's going to hold those, and then the board should look a little bit more familiar, okay? Now, um, the two browsers. Chromium, you're going to use this anything Google-based, because what you can do is sign into Google using your Middell email address, all right? Um, and then you can access Canvas via your Waffle, okay? Firefox, uh, you can log into ClassLink and get to your Envision videos, you can get in the PBS Kids, Go Noodle, all right? In either browser, the first thing you need to do as soon as the, the browser's open on the board, you want to go to the top right-hand corner and find the snowman, okay? And click on that snowman, and then it's gonna give you a menu of options. You're gonna ch check the box next to desktop site, okay? Um, you're not gonna see anything actually change on the board uh, but what that's going to do is just allow it tricks the the board and or tricks the websites into thinking that this board is an actual computer to log into your middell email account make sure you type in www.google.com and then that's going to reset the screen and bring up your sign-in box and then once you're signed in with your middell email address once you access your waffle all right uh, right now it doesn't have it in there but you're, you can reach canvas you can reach your drive um, I highly recommend using Chromium for those presentations that you have in a slide deck. Um, you don't need to tether yourself to the board. Bring it up in, in Chromium, uh, and you can present the information to the kiddos right then and there, okay? Uh, Jamboard is a really great option to use inside of here, too. Um, if you'd like support with that, just put a ticket in. Um, so I'm going to do the same thing. Don't forget, on the you got kind of your Vanna White button, so you don't have to go back and forth. I'm going to hit Home real quick and pull up Firefox. And Firefox, uh, it's gonna take you through, it might take you through whether light and dark theme and awesome options, but once that's set, I'm still gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna go to the top right-hand corner, hit the three dots, and I'm gonna turn on desktop site. So in Firefox, it's, it's a toggle. In, Cam, uh, in Chromium, it is a checkbox. So, but either one, the first thing you should do, kind of just make it part of your process, is open up the browser, go to the three dots, and turn on that desktop site. And now when you go to a website like Go Noodle. Um, those video features, okay, that media-based option I was talking about in terms of F Firefox are going to work a little bit cleaner inside of here. Um, you can already see the videos moving better than it did before. So um, that was just a quick run through on the browser. So Firefox, strong media-based things. Um, Chromium, anything that you're using here within Google. And then, of course, ClassLink. To go to ClassLink, let me go ahead and add that. Um, if you just, essentially, this is a search. This is a Google search browser. Um, if you just type in ClassLink, there's a login option, and then you click login here. 
uh, and then you can sign in with Google and then you would proceed with your Middell email address. Uh, if you need any training on any of these features, please submit a help desk ticket. Uh, yes, do a new line, that's fine. Um, but let us know that uh, in that request, if you put training request for browsers, um, our super awesome techs will know to send it uh, to me and Tiffany. All right, we'll see you next time, thanks.